Hey! Hi. Um, so, today is Saturday, um, but I'm gonna reconcile my uh, receipts because I'm going to Wonder Woman with my cousin-in-law today. So, um, I still have my $20 allowance from last week, and then I want to re reconcile so that I can get another $20 for going out, we're gonna go and get food, we're gonna go watch a movie, and that's what my allowance is for. My allowance is kind of my entertainment, my walking around, and things like that. So, um, anyway, time to reconcile everything. All right. Okay, so the way that I do this is I pull out all of my receipts that I've gotten or found. Uh, this one's a found one from February. So, uh, I don't think that, yeah, this one's just a lunch thing. I'm not super worried about it, but I'm gonna put it in with my big receipts bin. And this one is also February. So I'm gonna put this one in in my receipts. Thingamajigger. Majigger. Dealy ma Dealy my bobber. Okay, and then these are from right here. The 31st of last month. So I will go to last month because we just started this new month. And then I put Co. And this one is pets. And that total is fifty six ninety seven. Five six point nine seven. And the other one, because yes, they're uh it's a farm farm store and they're totally used to people spending money for their house and then for their farm and keeping it separate which is really funny and then she goes oh and you're paying cash she apparently has seen this before uh, garden that one is 5826 um oh, I do have a couple more noisy chair. I was thinking I had more. Um, this is for Napa Auto Parts. Um, for my car stuff, I buy with my debit card and I have a car savings account. So I put my gas money and my car repair replace money into that every month um so it's kind of like a cash envelope but i don't have to worry about oh do i have enough cash in my pocket to fill my tank because i'm totally budgeted perfectly fine probably over budgeted for my fuel but all the extra goes into my um car repair replace fund so instead of like pulling out cash and then not having the cash on hand and it just makes sense. Um, so I keep a hundred dollar buffer in my checking account. My fuel is never more than fifty dollars, so um, that works. And then when I get done with the transaction, then I just go into my mobile banking and transfer the money over to my checking account out of my sinking fund. So this one is for all the stuff to change my oil. I do that myself, and this was also on the 31st. So we we'll go uh, Napa oil change, uh, oil change. Don't mind my terrible handwriting. I swear, I write like a 13 year old boy. 47. 
48. 47, 48. And then um, when I was in my car, I found another, another receipt also from February. This one was for washer fluid. You know, like windshield washer fluid. Yep. Big spender. So I'm going to put this in with my receipts too. So it's kind of my way of keeping track of how much I spend on things for my truck. And yeah. Okay, so these, these three. Got my little folders. Gosh, this chair, man. Yay for one-handed. Okay. Wave water. This one is for a garden. Excuse me. And this one is for dewormer. That's for definitely the pets. Car allowance. Car key ritters. And the oil change stuff. Definitely car. That water running in the background. I don't know if you guys will be able to hear it or not. Um, that is my washing machine. I've done, done little tours of my washing machine before. It's an apartment washing machine. It's a portable washing machine. That's just what I've got right now. No, I don't have a dryer. Well, I do have a dryer. That's my clothes dryer right there. I got two of those plus another one. Energy efficient, man. And these were oops, all all February receipts. Oh my gosh. Come on. So much easier if we had more hands. Like, isn't there, like, the Indian <clears throat> Indian goddess that's got, like, a bazillion arms? That sounds kind of cool right now. Oh, oh. Okay. So, um, what I do is I reconcile the receipts. So this is all May stuff. So I have to go through this. It's usually part of my beginning of June. Let me double check that. Yeah, it's almost full. So I have to, I have to turn the water off here. Then you close the door and you turn on the agitator. Okay. <laughs> It works. Okay, so this is all uh, all May receipts. So I have to pull these out and transfer them over to here. This is month by month by month. So May receipts will go right there. Um, a part of why I'm doing this is that then I can go back and um, write down the different categories is something that I want to do. Like my... Um, how much I really spent on food, how much I really spent on my car. Double check that, um, that my balances are right. Uh, and I think that, I think that it would just be kind of interesting. This, this month is going to be really intense, um, because I think it was this month. I did a lot of big shops. Like I went to... Yeah, I went to a grocery outlet in New Seasons, plus I did a Safeway shopping, and <clears throat> another Safeway shopping. So I totally went, I'm pretty sure I went over budget in my groceries, but I still had the money in my, my envelopes, so... <clears throat> what I don't use grocery shopping for one month 
I'll put into my gardening fund. And so when I was going to buy this stuff it was for a special diet, I just pulled some money out of my gardening fund. But then I was still able to buy gardening stuff, so I don't know. It seems to work for me. That way I don't break my budget budget. It's all was budgeted before. And that's kind of my way of doing it. Um, yeah. So, um, yeah. That's kind of it. That's what I do every week. Now the fun part. The fun part. Not that part. Closer to this part. I get to go in. Bum, bum, bum. Guess who did her chores? I get a new 20. For my pocket, I get a 20 for my pocket. All right, so that's kind of what I do every week. That's uh, usually a Sunday ritual, but today is Saturday, and I wanted it for going out today. All right, it is time for me to get ready. It's 9.30 in the morning. I have to leave here in the next 40-ish um, minutes to go meet my cousin. I live out in the country, so it's 40 minutes to anything much I think it's like 35 minutes to drive to where we're gonna go watch a movie <sighs> all right oh and I need to take my it's a good thing I saw this that's on my fish oil gotta take my fish oil it's a cumulative effect you gotta take it all right all right happy weekend happy first weekend of June everybody um summer's on its way it is I don't know if you guys can see that it is dreary outside. Um, there's a mountain up above those trees there. You can't even see because the rain clouds are so low. Oh, look at that fly flying around. Yeah, it's kind of that season. Living out on the farm, you end up with um, lots of flies and lots of dust all the time. People are like, oh, clean, fresh country air. And it's just different air. <laughs> All right, okay, have a good weekend. Cheers.